Hi, my name is William Pitt, and I'm the inventor of the Skate Scepter. I thought I'd share this electric prototype that I made with you, because I think it's got a lot of cool features that you could incorporate in your design. This prototype, battery pack included, only weighs about 14 pounds. Look at this thing, it's really light. Now, with this battery pack, it still pushes me, and I weigh about 180 pounds, pushes me for about over three miles, at about 9 to 10 miles an hour, and with the current gearing, it pushes me up an incline about like this, and I'll demonstrate that later. This prototype also has this secondary handle here, which is really key in keeping this thing stable when you're under power. Ideally, it'd be nice to have some sort of quick release device right here, so that you just pop a button or twist something, and this whole thing could fold down and be parallel right with the mainframe. Now I'm using four lithium polymer batteries on this prototype. I actually got these from my RC helicopters that I fly. Now the way I put these battery packs together, it equals about 24 volts and about 5,000 milliamp hours of juice. And in total, they still only weigh about 550 to 600 grams. You could easily put a bigger battery pack on the skate scepter and it'd do great. These things could all be along the shaft of the handle like this, or what might even be cooler is if you use lithium ion batteries. You could actually get lithium ion cells in cylindrical cells, or you could even get lead acid in round sizes. And if you did that, you could put them all up and down side the handle here. You wouldn't even see a battery pack on the skate scepter. Now the cool thing is that with these lithium polymer batteries, since they're becoming really popular, they're getting pretty, pretty inexpensive. Retail, I paid about $22, $25 for each of these. So you gotta figure cost is like half of that. So now I'm gonna demonstrate just some basic performance of this prototype. I'm gonna show it pushing me around on some flats, some gradual hills, as well as a really steep hill. And I'll show you how steep it is. So I'm going to try and give you an idea of how steep this hill is that I'm going to demonstrate the skate scepter on. I've got a tennis ball here. I'm just going to let it go, and it's just going to start rolling on its own down the hill. It's a little hard to see on camera, but it is, it's a decent grade. There's the tennis ball. There's the hill. And here we go. Let go, and it just starts rolling. See you later, tennis ball. Now i got to go get it. So here we got our brushless motor. We've got a uh, scooter wheel, which I think is exactly like a Razor scooter wheel. Other side, we've got a chain drive here. It's direct drive coming off the motor. Here's the shaft. Here's the battery pack. And here's that auxiliary handle that you definitely need to have on there for stability. I'm very interested in seeing this product succeed, and I'd love for the opportunity to collaborate on bringing it to the market. So if you have any questions or you'd like to discuss prototypes, please give me a call or an email.